Hey guys, just going to do a quick how-to video on Inventor 2023. If you are new here, please consider subscribing and drop a comment for any requests for videos. Thanks for watching. So we're going to create the doors now. Um, we'll need to go to our assembly and get some measurements. Um, so we'll just pick a side. So M for measure. Um, select the side and then go the opposite side. So we're at 910. So I'm going to have a 5mm gap around the door. So we'll go 900. And then we'll want to measure. So M. We want to go from the corner up to. Not there. <laughs> corner up to here so we've got 376 and then five nineteen so we got 894 overall, 895, but we're going to take 10 mil off, so 885 by 900, and then we're just going to measure the face and this other face, and that'll give us our angle, so 159, so we're going to go create a new drawing, go sheet metal millimetres, create, I'll just check your sheet metal defaults, so the thickness is 2.5, the bend radius is 0 0.01, save and close, and then the K factor, point Two seven five and point two seven five. Save and close. So we're going to start a sketch. Get a rectangle to the two point center. We're just going to go the bottom of the door, so it was 376. Uh, 900 by 376. Finish the sketch. Now add the face to it. Now we're going to do this top part of the flange, and we wanted 519, and the angle I think would be 21. So click apply. We'll just save save this and we'll go to our assembly insert place component okay. just chuck it anywhere we just want to constrain it to the face and the face of that and then oh, we can click apply the face, the face of that, apply, and then we're going to go to the top of it, going to go mate, and the top of that return, now we're going to offset it, 5 mil, click apply, and then the same for this side, 
click that return in the side. And offset five, apply. So it's very close to being right. Looks like the angle is a bit too much. So we'll come back to the door. Edit. Uh, edit feature. Just gotta grab it sometimes to get it to move. On the right way. Twenty one point six. That's better. There we go. There it is. Feature and we'll go twenty point eight. I think that'll be right. Save. Yeah, looks better. Close enough. Save that. So now I've got the gap there. I want this point to go a bit higher, so we will go to the door and then edit the flange. Take two mil off it. Save it and come back to the assembly. 
pretty close. We'll just go one more. So flange at a feature. We'll just go 16. So 516. Okay. Save. Mm -hmm. I'll go down here. That's pretty close. Play around with your angles. So we're going to go back to the door now and put some flanges onto it. So for the first one, we're going to go 30 mil overall. We're going to go select so we're going to go all of them, and then we're going to come up here to bend uh, corner. Sorry, we go miter gap. We'll go. 0.8 and apply and then I'm gonna go these But we'll leave the top ones because it could be close to the return on the canopy. We might grab on it, so we'll just leave it like that. So we'll go corner, it's still 0.8. And we're just going to go 14.5 overall. And then apply. So again, if you've got a dog box or something, just go near sketch, chuck your holes or whatever pattern you want in there, and then finish your sketch, and then cut the holes out. Now we've got the canopy finish, we'll just add some extra stuff to it, so we'll start by making um, like a roof rack for it, um, so we'll just go new I'll go standard millimeter great we'll just make some um, SHS so we'll go select the surface we'll just go rectangle two point center and we'll just go 40 by 40 finish sketch extrude uh, we'll just go say 50 okay now we'll do the same thing new sketch here so we'll go 37 by 37 finish and then extrude but we'll cut through it Okay, so now we've got a bit of SHS. We'll just save that. File. And we'll just edit this. We'll go. 
1400. Okay, edit this. Go 1400. Yep, now save that. Save that. Nine fifteen. So now we'll come down to this. We'll start placing some parts. Just select all of these. Open. Oh, no, we won't, because they're everywhere. Train and flush. We'll go constrain.
measure. I have no idea what I was working out. Um, 534. So it needs to go three mil less. Where was it? Show. Edit. Thirty-seven. Okay. Measure. Five thirty-seven point five. That'll do. Done. So we're gonna constrain all of these. with these ones. Why? Why? because we didn't take the the thicknesses off. Okay. 
One, we'll go to the face of that to the face of one of these. Apply. We'll go flush with this. Apply. And we'll go flush this to that. Apply. Same for this one. Apply. something up there or put more RHS on the inside to support it for a rooftop tent or something yeah that's it 